Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I will show you how to recover data from a dying hard drive. So let's get started. First step is to check the health of your hard disk. Connect the faulty hard disk to your PC using SATA or external USB to SATA adapter. There are many tools available, but for this video, we'll be using three main tools. First one is Crystal Disk Info. Second one is C Tools by Seagate. Third one is Crystal Disk Mark. Now first, execute Crystal Disk Info and select your drive. Here you can see the status of your drive. Anything other than good means that your data is at risk. You can check the below log to figure out actual problem. You can also Google the error and find the fix. In my case, the error was higher reallocation sector counts, which means few sectors on hard disk are damaged and cannot be fixed. C Tools by Seagate is one of the best tools to analyze health of your storage drive. It works with storage devices from multiple manufacturers and can detect errors easily. On main screen, select your bad hard drive and go to basic test. Here you can see four different tests. Run them one by one and if one of them fails, then it means that your hard disk is about to die. Third tool is Crystal Disk Mark. It is one of the benchmarking tool used to check speed of drive. But in this scenario, we'll use this tool to check the health. Dying hard drives will show less speed as compared to healthy drives. If your drive fails one of this test, you need to back up your data from your drive. You can manually copy data from bad drive to good drive, but if the drive is in really bad state, you will get speeds in kilobytes per seconds, which will make it impossible to transfer all the data. In such situations, you need to use Roadkill Unstoppable Copier, a free tool which will help you copy files quicker as compared to default copier. Just select the source drive and then destination drive and cloning process will start. Hope this video was helpful to you. For more stuff like this, subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.